Hi there, and welcome to this tutorial on how to change chords quick on the flamenco guitar. Today I'll be showing you uh, three different chords in this lesson, which you can download and print along with your uh, tab and standard notation at uh, Patreon dot com forward slash flamenco for you. In exercise number one, you'll be using an A major chord or La Mayor with the fretting fingers being finger one, barring or performing a sajilla on the fourth and third strings along the second fret. And finger two placed on the second string along the second fret. The right hand striking fingers are M and A. Now these fingers will be striking together along the uh, fifth, fourth, and third, and second strings. Now if you've seen previous tutorials of mine, you know how to hold the La Mayor chord along the second fret the right way, which is the finger one holding the sahia, like I showed you, and not fingers one, two, and three, holding down all the notes. We also aren't using fingers two, three, and four. We are just using fingers one and two, okay? So the next chord, A sharp, or La Sostenido, is fretted with finger one on the fifth string along the first fret, finger two on the fourth string along the third fret, finger three on the third string along the third fret, and finger four on the second string along the third fret. Here we go. One, two, three. Now for exercise number two, we start where we left off in the first exercise, which was La Mayor, striking that chord once again with M and A. In the second bar, which you'll see in the tab and standard notation that you can download and print over at patreon.com forward slash flamenco for you, is the C9 number five or Do Nueve, numero cinco. But just to avoid a headache, we'll just call it Do. Now Do is fretted with finger two on the fifth string along the third fret, finger one on the fourth string along the second fret, finger three on the third string along the third fret, and finger four on the second string along the third fret. Now combining the two chords in exercise number two, we repeat these together until we've got it down. One, two, three, A sharp. C, A sharp. Now in exercise number three, we put it all together using the same right hand fingers, which are once again, M and A. Here we go. One, two, three. In exercise number four, we do the same thing with the fretting fingers as we did in the previous exercise, but this time the right hand will be striking the strings only with the I finger. The I finger will strike the fifth, fourth, and third strings. And make sure that you are anchoring your thumb on the sixth string in this instance, because the thumb is hooked facing down rather than upward at the default position. This is because we want to steer clear of the fifth string giving ourselves room to strike that fifth string, which is our A, or La, without the possibility of muting it. So that we don't want. Here we go. One, two, three. Now, the final exercise, number five, we will take what we did in the previous exercise, taking out the strike we did on the uh, one count, and replace it with a golpe, which is hit using the A finger, or anillo. Here we go. One, two, three. And that's it. So thanks for watching, and most importantly, don't forget to help our channel out by clicking the like button, and if you want to see more, hit subscribe.